How's it going, everybody? My name's Piffy, and welcome to Battlefield 1. Uh, it's been a long time since this game has been out, uh, but I, th I thought, wh why not Why not play the campaign? I got nothing but time here. Let's play Let's play the campaign. Let's, let's, have, let's have a little bit of tea first. It's delicious. I was about to play on my keyboard. I don't know why. This is PlayStation, yo. So, um, I, I've played some of these before, not ringing a whole lot of bells with them, but I'm going to play one that I've never played before, which looks really cool. It's called The Runner. Uh, a storm of beaches, storm of the beaches of Gallipol. I don't know if that's, I can't tell, because the quality's not so good with, uh, remote play. Whew. Under the guns of the largest naval fleet assembled. We came from all over the world. The innocent, the arrogant, and the brave. We thought the war was to be our rite of passage. A grand adventure that would make us all equal in our quest for glory. But instead of adventure, we found fear. And in war, the only true equalizer is death. Mm. Very inspiring words. War is all about death, pretty much. The Dardanelles. The Gallipoli Peninsula, spring 1915. The British Empire intends to open a new front of the war. Uh, plans for an unprecedented naval invasion of the Ottoman homeland are drawn up. And the attacking naval force represents the biggest single fleet yet assembled. The gathered ships carry over half a million men. The force is drawn from Australia. I did not get the chance to read that. Pause it if you like and read it yourself. Day 1. At Cape Hells, the steamship river Claude is used to as a Trojan horse crashing onto the beach to deploy several battalions of Allied soldiers. A tenuous beachhead is seized. Half... It's fine. Wish I could press a button. I would like to read that stuff. I really love these cinematics of um, of the Battlefield 1 campaign. They're very, very beautiful and good stories. I hope that they always do this in every game that they make. Frederick Bishop? Are you Frederick Bishop? No, nope. he's dead. Sorry. <laughs> but uh, isn't this your picture? I suppose so. Jack Foster. I I'm your new charge. No, you're not. You just took his you picture. Take this kid off me. <laughs> of course not. He came all this way <laughs> just to see you, Frederick Bishop, the pride of Australia. The pride of Australia. <laughs> Uh oh, not supposed to do that. <laughs> the real reason why he doesn't want that kid with him is because he doesn't want to see him die. You know Morse code? Yes. Follow me. He doesn't want to befriend him by him being his partner and just watch him die. That's that's what he's really worried about here. Right, what a disaster. Yeah. Our first wave didn't stand a chance. Look at all their defenses. How can we take the beach? Oh, I think I don't. I don't know how I have this set. I think I have it set to. Uh, I need headphones. Maybe. War tapes. What is that? Stereo. Stereo. Yes. Announcer voice: female, male. We have the dreadnoughts this time. Plug your ears, kid. It's gonna be loud. Dreadnoughts. Ooh. New objective. Direct the dreadnought barrage. You got it, mate. How I look through these headphones. Or the these, these binoculars. Right. There we go. Send these coordinates. Oh, there it is. The most powerful weapon in the world at that time. Boom! 
Look at her mistress blow them up. See, the bad thing is those people died. I know that they're shooting stuff at us, but jeez, man. These people are dead now. Time to go. Whoa, where do you think you're going? With you. Glad where you go. Yeah, okay, you're staying here. <laughs> and you will move up with rear command only after I fire the signal flare. Yes, sir? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Try to stay out of trouble. See, he doesn't want him to die. That's the whole that's the whole purpose. To get to the top of the bridge. All right, let's get them, boys. Get them. Let's fucking fire in this beach, dude. They did a fantastic job of uh making this feel like war. I've never been to war, but Jesus. I can imagine this is what it was like. Close enough. Fuck. I need to see where the enemy's at. That's where we gotta go. Shit. Got him. Move up. What is this? Oh, is this a shotgun? Oh boy, this is a shotgun! My favorite weapon in the battle! Come on, lads, push me the top. We gotta get to the top. And remember, if my aim is bad, it's because I'm playing remote play, not because I suck, okay? This was normal. These bitches would already be dead. Like I said, remote play. Remote play. God, this was an old feller. I mean, for war. Was it like 50, 60 years? No, 50, 55 something years old, maybe? Couldn't do that math that quickly in my, in my head, brains. Damn it, I want to keep pressing run from like a. No Man's Sky run. Oh, this is gonna be difficult. Righty ho. Oh, jeez. Reload the weapon. Shit, shit. No, remote play, what are you doing? What are you doing? Quit it, remote play. No! What's happening? No! Quit it! Oh my god. This is what I have to deal with. This is what I have to deal with, playing with remote play. Jesus. Get him, mate. I need to uh, open a weapon crate. What's this? Take it. What's this? What the fuck is this thing? Oh, it's a grenade launcher. Oh. I like that. Dude, imagine just getting freaking buckshotted right in the freaking belly. Just someone turns around the corner and just... Oh! Hold. I was contemplating putting this on hard mode as well. But I thought, nope, nope. Remote play, don't need to do that. Ah, got him. Shit, dude. This is terrible. New objective. Capture the Hell's Overlook. I don't know how to pronounce that. I'm sorry if I said it wrong. Right, what's in here? I need this. That's how you work the trenches right here. Oh, 
Oh, dude, you don't just you don't just run out in front of everybody, okay? That's not how this works. Get in here. Get out. Oh shit. Dude, he's right in front of you. What the hell? Shit, they're in my cover! I don't have nothing to get behind now! Oh, Jesus. Go get him, boys! Let's do this! Ugh, got him. Okay, he's dead. I like to take my time, sorry. Okay, here we go. Oh, shit! Oh no, I need that back, I need that back. My shotgun is useful, but my carbine here is... I need that more now. Ugh. I think it's really, really cool how you can hide behind something and it can actually like get destroyed. That's what's really cool. It makes the element of the game a little bit more like tense. Like I don't have anything to hide behind now. What am I gonna do? Oh shit. No, 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 no. Oh god. Whenever it starts doing that, I start freaking out. Because it, it kind of like plays on its own, sort of. Like the, the buttons start moving on their own. Shit, I'm almost out of ammo, dude. Can you guys not fire, like, bullets? Your guns not work? Pretty sure they do. Last time I checked, mine did. What is this? I need, uh, we got, we got ammo? We got ammo in this bitch? Anything? Move in! Got him. Oh shit! Ah! Did I get him with the fucking hammer? Jesus Christ! My God! Okay. Far so good. Where's the uh, where's the objective at? Sit here. Where's all my fucking mates at, man? Shit. I am out of fucking ammo. Like right like really really bad out of ammo. Oh, don't do this to me now. Okay, so far so good. I think I'm good, like, now. I think I had to kill everybody and then take over. Time to send up the flare. All right. 
That's the reality of war and military. That's what you could get yourself into. No, you're not. You're Australian. <laughs> Impossible to kill. <laughs> Isn't Liam Neeson Australian? Or is he? So. I'm pretty sure he's Australian. Not Kiwi, are you? <laughs> <laughs> now, this thing's first. I don't know what that means, but that was like some really funny, like, relief there to the situation. Follow me. I'm in here. Just I'm out. Look at him. Butt him to your shoulder. That's it. Cheeky against the butt. No, that's it. Point it where you want to shoot. That's it. Okay. Just feet apart a little bit. He's <sighs> teaching him how to not die. Think I already lost my Australian. <laughs> Not you, the boy. We need a runner for the front line. Uh oh. No. Yes. No. You can't make the kid do it. You just stumble into a firefight and get killed. No, 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 I can do it. No. I'll do it. <gasps> Old timer, being the runner. Fine. You're here with me, and you, you will be running. Look at his eyes. Battle Harden. There's no telling what they've seen. I need to find a way past this. Go, go, everybody, go! I just wasted my grenades. Seriously, I thought I was going into a good situation there. Okay. I don't know if I'm supposed to be in here. But I like how the maps are open. Like, you're free to choose where you want to go. That's nice. Shit. I uh, did bad. I did bad. I did a bad. I did very bad. I did very, very bad. I did very bad. It's supposed to go a little this way. But I went straight to the middle. Now, how I'm supposed to do. Spot in yeah, spotting enemies can help. You wanna tell me how I can spot enemies? Thank you. Don't waste the ammo if I don't have to. Pick that up. <coughs> I feel like this uh the C4 is actually gonna help. Oh my god, you see how much fucking ammo I've got? I've got nothing. I've got nothing. Alright, let me try this out. That was the grenade. That wasn't spotting, that was a grenade. Oh, I've got I've got how you're supposed to do this now. Check me out. Check me out. Alright, I'm probably gonna die here, but that's fun. That's fun. I can handle dying. I've died before. I've died plenty of times. Ah, go. This game's not about killing them all. This game's about running. Well, I mean, not, not the game. This the the mission. The mission's about running. Oh shit, shit. That's why you have limited fucking ammo. Oh shit! Run towards the explosions! Get up! Get up! Fucking get up! Get in here! Get, get in here! Get out! This whole thing is going to shit. I need to get back to Whitehall. Hey, it's my boys! Look, it's my boys! There they are. Report back to the commanding officer. What? No! I gotta go back now? I'm all the way over here! What do we got? 
Oh, we got ourselves a shotgun. Nice. I'll take it. Hey, I, I know you're not dead yet, but um, you have a weapon. Anybody have a weapon? I could possibly borrow. What's this? Open crate. Oh, look at this field manual. That's just something that you're supposed to uh, have for like um, the missions and stuff. It's not necessary, but having ammo is necessary. Jesus. What I was supposed to do, or what would have worked, is I would have thrown a grenade, and I would have put out my C4 mines and stuff. And, um, they would have been drawn to the area. Ooh, now that's what I'm talking about. Oh, ho, ho, ho. don't fuck with me. I've got this thing. And then when they're drawn to the area, I light up my C4. I need to get back to water. I'm going, I'm going. I gotta take my time though, I gotta look around the corners. Corners is what gets you killed, man. I keep wanting to press my jetpack. I don't have a jetpack. This is World War One, baby! You don't get jetpacks in World War One. Maybe if I get down here, they'll see me. They'll be, they'll know it's me. Oh Jesus! Oh, that was fucking nice. That was nice. We gotta defend the camp. Get on the gun. Oh shit, dude, that guy... That guy was doomed from the beginning. Okay, Whitehall. Where, where's he at? Where's he at? Is he in here? Don't tell me he's dead. Don't tell me he's been shot. Oh. Fucking nice, kid! I almost want to cry. <laughs> but I didn't. Oh. Sure fucking didn't. <laughs> nice shot. Oh, well, you know, I just kind of saw him out there and I... Uh, you know, I just kind of... Uh, uh, you got falling lines across the board. That's what I thought. Bishop, go tell rear command that we'll be moving up. Don't worry. I can handle myself here. I hope so. Head down. No open areas. Got it. Got it. You can learn something from this guy if, like, you actually want to play FPS games. Head down. Crouch. To to no open me. areas. Have a wall beside you. Make your open area your only firing position. And don't have a gun with a fucking clip the size of your head right on top of your... Where you're supposed to aim, man. That's another thing. Right here on the enemy freaking lines, man. Where is everyone? Uh oh. Hey, horsey. Can I ride you? <gasps> I can. I'm not going to though because I know I'm not supposed to yet. <clears throat> I bet. Um. I bet they evacuated because they know something that we don't know. Like uh. Oh, here we go. Read retreat order. For those who didn't hear from a runner, the Allied position is lost. Artillery fire ordered to cover retreat to beach, shelling the village and outlying forts. Shit. Foster. Alright, so we gotta hop on the horse. We gotta get back. We gotta tell him to go. Shelling in position to cover retreat. Let's go, horsey!
Wait, I gotta go this way. Woo! Dude, I love this horse. I've never played with a horse before, but... Can I have a sword? No, go, 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 go! Shit! Not good! Not good! Where's he at? Defend the front line. What front line, dude? Oh shit, there is no fucking front line. This is like front circle. They're defending from everywhere. I guess this is the front line now. Jesus, guys, you need to make up your damn mind. War was much more brutal than this. I can tell you that. I mean, I wasn't there or anything, but... I've actually, uh, I've actually heard stories from, uh, old-timers in the hospitals that I, that I work at, um... Uh, yeah, go to hell. Get out of here. Objective complete. Where's he at? I need to tell him. You tell them that they're gonna shell the fuck out of this place. Full scale retreat. They're gonna shell the village and the fort to cover us. We need to get out now. I, I sent men up to secure the fort. A dead man. Who went? Oh no. Only those who volunteered. So naturally, all of them. Fucking kids. Well, you remember being his age. Foster. Shit. This isn't good. He's gonna die. I can tell already he's gonna die. Go. I'll pretend I didn't see you. This isn't on you. Of course it is. One more death for me to live with. Go, go, you don't have much time. Hmm. Sadness. Sadness all around. Some of the stories that I've heard from the few that they want to tell from like actual World War II veterans and World War like that era. Um, Someone fought by myself and I called Foster a pinhead. It is pretty bad stuff. My great granddad was uh, in World War II and um, from what the family said uh, he never really told stories, so... That kind of tells you anything. Respect your local vet. They're there, and you just don't know it. And some of them didn't have a choice, either. Maybe there's a way I can go about the sneak elitely. Okay. Just move up and over. Take this back, take this back. There we go. None of them seen me. <laughs> I actually went in, got the weapon I wanted, and got out. Nice! I'm good. I'm good. Oh, okay. Remote play just wants me to walk right back. Okay, hold on. There we go. Alright. This is not the time. Oh, 
Oh, hold up now. How many fucking shots is it gonna take to kill one person? I thought I was actually winning when I got this gun, but no, sir! I actually just sun moan death warrant. I actually got a headshot with this gun and it didn't kill him. See? Two headshots is what it takes to kill with this gun. It must be a fucking 22. I hate it when you're on like certain parts of the map like where it always respawns enemies and that, like that's how you're supposed to uh like you're supposed to progress forward because they uh they keep respawning and you can never tell shit i don't have a distance weapon crap hello Oh my god, really? I'm used to playing in hardcore mode as well. In hardcore, uh, pretty much one bullet from any gun kills you. <laughs> hardcore, whenever I play multiplayer, uh, just on normal, I feel like the weapons don't do enough damage. And I usually get cheated out of kills. Especially because I'm using sniper rifles. And I feel that sniper rifles, for the most part, should be a one-shot kill. And most all cases that may just be me but I felt cheated so I started playing hardcore mode and I have not quit oh, where's the entrance to this damn place yeah just climb up this hill here eh, eh. guess I can't we're gonna have to take the road you're not gonna let me go that way yeah that puts me in more combat action. Okay, so, um... Oh, what the fuck is that? Oh, that's... <laughs> you can throw bullets. I forgot. Bu bullet shells. Going sniper elite here. Yeah, I just want to make sure I'm not going to get screwed here. Because I've come a long way. There we go. Alright, now what's in here? Please be good weapon. Good weapon? Ooh. Alright, bye bye shotgun. I have to switch you now. I'm sorry. Oh, this is one of the guns I use in multiplayer. Sorry, I know it's taking me a long time. But, uh... I actually like to take my time instead of just rushing through. I like doing the battle like you're supposed to, not Call of Duty. Call of Duty's trash, yo. Here we go. Open the doors! Want to shoot me, dude? Come on, let's get you out of here. This place is about to come down any moment. Uh, we can't leave, there's still hostiles coming, and we can't outrun them with our wounded. You get gone, then I'll cover your retreat. 
The bishop is still. I'll make it look like I'm capturing the fort. It'll be enough distraction. Once you get past Allied lines, send up a flare. Let me know you're safe. I'll make my retreat then. Oh, so you're disobeying orders now? Well, I assume you did to come here. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. You're a proper Aussie now. <laughs> Gotta look the part. Up and at him, lads. Let's go. Oh, man. It's heroic. Heroic for both of them. Well, this is it, I guess. Double kill! Triple kill! And BAM! Dude, I shot him in his freaking left ventricle. He should have died. Oh, burst fire. Awesome. I like burst fire weapons. Nice. Death awaits. Ah. Got him. Shit. Don't don't do this to me now, please. Shit, shit, shit. Retreat, retreat, retreat. Okay. No, 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 no. What the hell? He should be dead! Shit, shit, fuck, man. I don't know. I made a bad decision. I made a bad, uh, I made a poor choice. Poor life decision here. I need to change the color of my, uh... Oh, shit. Oh, man. Well, this isn't good. Hey! Wait, can I actually do that? No, I can't. I can't actually do that. Bad idea! Lose the game idea! <laughs> I thought, why can't I just go run down with them? I'll cover them. I can do it. I'm a fucking Australian, mate. Jesus. Running out of ammo. Urgh. Not looking good for me. Jesus Christ. Oh my God. Hold on guys, time out, let me heal for a minute. Why is this gun not doing damage anymore? Oh, another flamethrower. Good. Good. It's another one, guys. It's another flamethrower.
shit. Whew, got him. <laughs> uh, any more of those around here? <laughs> Somebody help me, I need something. This this will do, I guess. It's gonna have before, but all right. What's this? Give this to me, I guess? Yeah. Oh, it's a big one. Captured the courtyard. Yes. I did it, guys. Oh, shit. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh no, please be the flare. Yes, no. Nice. That's what you want to see. Don't die, please. Oh no. Yeah, he's dead. Savage fighting continued for nine months, but would ultimately result in a hard won victory for the Ottomans. The held Gallipoli. Almost a hundred thousand Ottoman soldiers gave their lives while defending their homeland. From their ranks came from from the ranks came the battle proven leaders that would for the first time Australians and New Zealanders fought under their own flag. Tales of heroism and mateship were pivotal for in forging their national identities. It's really good that they're actually telling you the story of the war rather than just saying, Go fucking kill everybody. It's war. Guns blazing. Boots stomping, it's, yeah, like, it actually tells you about what your death actually means in the game. It doesn't mean, hey, uh, look, you died, start over. It means, hey, you died, so did a lot of other people, m hundreds of thousands of other people. So that's really cool. I mean, it's not really cool, but I mean, it's very, it's very interesting and it's very different to see uh, in a game, because normally you don't see this type of thing in games, so... Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and in this episode here uh, next we might do nothing is written or Friends in high places friends in high places is definitely one of my favorites because I'm really big into aviation especially like World War two era World War one era uh, planes Like the biplanes and things like that. They're my favorite type of aircraft, so I hope you guys enjoyed this. I'm going to do the whole series of the war stories and uh, anything else that I find interesting in Battlefield 1. If you like this, be sure you press the like button, subscribe to the channel, and take it easy. Keep it real!